Hi guys, welcome back to Debris Day. Today on Debris Day is TV OS 13 Beta 4. Let's go guys. So just before I get started, um, TVOS 13 Beta 4 came out yesterday evening, just had a chance to download it. Going to put it on the old uh, TVOS box behind me as normal. Um, I was just wondering though guys, uh, I have access to like, iPadOS, um, all of the Catalina updates, all of the iPhone updates. Do you want me to do any videos on those? Let me know below. Okay, um, usual stuff, quickly get it downloaded and let's see what's changed. Let's go. So just to confirm, I'm on TVOS 13 17J 5515E, that is beta 3, update software. You can see the new version 17J 5526E, that is the next version, which is beta 4. Let's get that installed. Okay, there we have it, TVOS 13 beta 4. Let's have a quick squizzle, let's see what's in there. What I'd like to say is, I download uh, these images from, from Apple, um, and because the betas are so new, they don't really give you much details about what's changed them. So it's a bit of a experimentation to try and find out what's going on in it. So let's have a look anyway. Um, let's try the uh, arcade, see if that works yet. I do know when this does start happening that we can use our Xbox controller and connect up to it. That's something I found out the other day, so we'll try and get that going. Clearly it's not working at the moment. Let's come out of there. Interestingly, it's like the sound stopped. Ah, oh, it's just very, very quiet. Okay, cool. Um, let's just jump down to the settings, just double check. Um, see that we're on the right version. So, yeah, up to date, there we go. 17J5526E, so that's a beta 4. Um, let's go straight away out of here and out of here and out of here. And let's try the screen savers. I want to get these underwater screen savers because I really like those. Um, ooh, I haven't seen that one before. So the lower Manhattan. I do love the screen savers. Those of you that watch the channel know that I love the screen savers on here. Uh, keep going through. I'm not expecting them to be on here at the moment. Um, what happened last time with um, TVOS 12 or 12 beta 1 beta 2, they didn't give you the screen savers until really late on in the beta program. So I'm expecting the same here. Um, so nothing really is happening there. Let's go back. Let's dive down into the settings. Let's go to uh, video and audio. Just double check. That all looks the same. Let's dive over to general. Screensaver, see if there's any options there to change it to underwater. No, just aerial. So what I'm expecting to be up here is once they've updated it, is to say underwater, So, uh, but it's not saying that at the moment. Uh, let's come out of there. Let's go and go to the TV, my TV app. Uh, so obviously been watching some films. Let's try TV shows anything different on there. Um, not that I can see. Uh, that all looks normal. Today's highlights, game face, things that are happening today. Nothing there. Okay, let's try the search. Batman. So that kind of works. Uh, there's nothing new there. So let's go back up to here. Uh, let's go to movies, let's see if there's anything in difference in here. Uh, I'll start Captain Marvel, new film, if you haven't seen it, go and see it, great film. Uh, now I've already purchased this, so why is it asking me to buy it? That's a little bit worrying. Right, so that's peculiar. Okay, so this is from the TV app. I'm going to dive back into iTunes and just see if it has any different view on this. So let's go to uh, iTunes Movies. Um, let's have a look, see if it asks me to purchase it in here. So I know I've purchased it. Let's just see what the difference is. As you can see, play, I've purchased. So clearly there's a problem there that the TV, uh, TV app doesn't recognize that I've already purchased uh, Captain Marvel. So that's something for you to note. So if you go into there and hit uh, play or buy, it's going to charge you again, I guess. Um, let's come out of there. Uh, let's go and have a little wander around. Let's go into TV shows. So if there's anything new in here. Uh, 
Ah, Chernobyl, by the way, if you haven't seen Chernobyl, ah, oh, amazing. Let's just give that a try. You can buy it, you can buy the entire series. Hmm, again, not a lot that I'm noticing is different. Okay, uh, let's go to the Apple Music. It's such a shame there's no big differences appearing in this. I know on things like um, uh, iPad OS and iOS 13, on things like your iPhone, there's major differences, but I haven't seen anything major different on, the, on here. This looks slightly different. I haven't seen this view before. Um, so things for me, I'm a member of uh, Apple Music as well, so we get that. Let's just try something on here. I'll only play it for a few seconds so I don't get uh, hit by the copyright. All right, clearly that works. No lyrics, hmm, interesting. I thought I gave you lyrics to everything. Let's try this one. Ah, so only again, lyrics on certain ones. Let's come out of there, pause that music and pop out of there. What else can we look at? Let's have a little browse around. Arcade, we've tried photos. So look at the app store. So if there's anything specific on the app store. Uh, interesting, Disney Life is on there. I didn't realize. I believe Disney Life, isn't that going to be the Disney movies? I think it is. I think that's now there. Um, one thing I have heard, um, if you try and download the Apple trailers, um, then it has caused problems with the previous version. So let me quickly get the Apple trailers uh, application. Apple trailers. Let's download that. Let's quickly install that. I'll give that a try. Okay, we're back. Let's, uh, let's get Apple movie trailers. Let's just open that up. And let's try uh, one of these, if it changes anything. So these are the trailers. Um, I happen to like sci-fi, um, as you can probably tell by my choices of uh, films. Let's go, oh, sci-fi's not in there. That's a bit of a shame. Let's go thriller instead then. Uh, let's try the operative. And do the trailer, see if that works, or the same works. Oh, that's working. Okay, so we know that works. And the sound's still working. So that's obviously been fixed in this version. Uh, let's pop out of there. And let's dive back to the screensavers, see if there's any new screensavers yet. Because I know they don't load over time, you see. So I'm just dropping back. Helps I push the right button. Let's just drop back and go to the screensavers. So there's any new ones about underwater? It doesn't look like it. No, not much going on there at all. Um, so we checked that, checked TV shows. Computers I want to check, traders we checked. Infuse is really good, guys. If you haven't got Infuse, I would recommend getting Infuse. Um, that's about it. I can't see anything significantly changing on here. Um, what I'm gonna do, uh, I'll do some digging around on the internet, see if I can get the release notes. See what they've actually changed on here. But um, I can't see anything at the moment. So at the moment, that's uh, TVOS 13 Beta 4. Probably just some bug fixes, not anything major uh, has happened with it. Um, sorry about that, guys. Every video can't be amazing big uh, announcements, but hopefully things will get better on TVOS 13. That's it for now, guys. Quick mini update on TVOS 13 Beta 4. Look forward to seeing you next week on Doobies Day. Cheers then. Bye.